For more than 30 years, Earl Monkbatten of Burma had spent every August in the quiet Irish fishing village of Mullock Moor in County Sligo. On the 27th of that same month in 1979, he was assassinated by the IRA, blown up in his fishing boat with his 14-year-old grandson and a local boatman. The death of the 79-year-old war hero and statesman, the Queen's cousin, shocked the nation and struck at the very heart of the British establishment. The IRA later said they'd executed Lord Louis, as they put it, blowing up the boat by remote control. At the funeral in London a few days later, thousands of mourners lined the streets to pay tribute to one of the great figures of the post-war years. The Queen, the Queen Mother and Prince Andrew, dressed in the uniform of a midshipman, led the mourners at the service in Westminster Abbey. Kings, queens and princes from all over Europe and the Commonwealth joined the congregation in singing the Sailor's Hymn. Batten's last parade was conducted with all the precision he would have expected of such a great occasion. As his coffin was carried off for burial at his country home at Romsey, the loss to the royal family of this most trusted advisor was incalculable. <laughs> 